Interesting topic to discuss today regarding Henry Cavill, Deadpool 3. But if you have missed anything recently, go ahead and check out those videos that are there on my channel. And if you're new to the channel, thank you for checking it out. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy this video. So recently, there was a rumor that dropped. Well, let's go back, actually. A couple weeks ago, there was a rumor coming out about Henry Cavill possibly accepting a Marvel role is supposedly something that people wouldn't expect. So I did cover that on the channel. Now, kind of follow, you know, piggybacking off of that, there is another rumor coming out in that same topic coming from the Twitter account, Kevin Gets Some Toast, and they post scoops and things like that. Now, I'm not saying that this is true or not true. I have absolutely no idea. I just want to talk about what the possible rumor is. According to this person, I can confirm that Henry Cavill will in fact play a Wolverine variant in Deadpool and Wolverine. Fans will be very pleased with his appearance. Now, Deadpool 3, again, is called Deadpool and Wolverine. I did do a trailer reaction to the trailer for that movie, if you're interested in checking that out too. But this, of course, is extremely interesting to think about. There have been, you know, fan art and things like that created of Henry Cavill as Wolverine. I think this would be amazing to see if this happens. We know that there are going to be different variants seen of different characters in Deadpool and Wolverine. So everyone would like to know who's going to play these other variants of Wolverine. We know Hugh Jackman is going to be, is coming back as Wolverine in this film, but who else are we going to see as a Wolverine variant? Now, if, if Henry Cavill shows up as one, oh my God, I think people's, I think fans will, we're just gonna be like, no way, no way. It would be so cool. I think it'd be really cool. And in my video talking about did Henry Cavill possibly accept some Marvel role, one of my concerns was that would it be something that was taken seriously and not watered down and dumbed down? And I honestly don't think that he would take a role like that in the Marvel universe, but that would be a concern of mine if it's true that he accepted a, a role in Marvel. This though, if it's true, brings a little bit of comfort in that area to me personally, because I feel like this would be the kind of movie that would respect Henry Cavill and, you know, if he is possibly a Wolverine variant. But Deadpool obviously has a lot of different, a lot of humor because of the type of character that Deadpool is. And it's just, it's a little bit different from the humor and the types of comedy that we get in the other Marvel Universe movies. First of all, Deadpool wasn't even part of the MCU until now. So I think this would be a way to have Henry Cavill in the Marvel Universe. I don't think it'd be a commitment. I don't think it would be a long-term role. I mean, I could be totally wrong. It definitely could be, but I don't know if he'd be taking that on right now because he is doing his own project at Amazon Prime, you know, lots of other projects as well in the future. So I don't know if he would take on something like that that would be like this long-term thing, but maybe just for this movie, you know what I mean? Which would be kind of bittersweet because it'd be like a one-off type of thing, but I think it would still be really cool to see. It would give him the opportunity to be a badass character. Not to mention, it would be really cool to see him and Ryan Reynolds together and interact in some way. So Deadpool and Wolverine does come out in theaters July 26th of this year. And if there's anything that even hints at that in a trailer or if more stuff comes out as we get closer to movies, things get leaked, I think it'd be a pretty cool surprise in the theater. So hopefully nothing like that gets leaked ahead of time, but I think it possibly could. This is already potentially a spoiler, but like actually, seeing or hearing more of that before the movie comes out from screeners and from, you know, premieres and press premieres and stuff like that could possibly get leaked in some way or continue to get even more spoiled than this if it's true. Definitely leave your thoughts below. Tell me what you think. How would you react to this if this ends up being true? But thank you guys for watching. Check out anything you might have missed recently, including the short section. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe as well. And hit the notification bell so you can be aware when I post a new video. But thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time.